on key view your exhausted 91.7 fm i'm your host captain quality and uh let's see we've already been uh, playing an hour's worth of uh zolo within the new wave and from the u.s and we should continue on with another hour right up until 10 p.m when the uh nummy muffin cocoa butter show comes on 
to fulfill the rest of your wacky fantasies. I'm Captain Quality, and uh, with you here every Wednesday at 9 p.m. I just had sort of a special uh, extended show tonight. I uh, started off at 8, and um, we just heard from the residents with uh, Dumbo the Clown from the Subterranean Moderns compilation. Before that, uh, Pink Section with Shopping from their uh, only 7-inch. Prefix from their only 7-inch, Ectomorphine was the song. Tuxedo Moon with Pinheads on the Move from their first 7-inch. And Los Microwaves with Is There Life After Breakfast from the Life After Breakfast album, their first, 1981. Those are all groups from the Bay Area, Berkeley, San Francisco, right around there. And uh, all around uh, 78, 79, 80, Los Microwaves, 81. So, uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, the number is 495-KVRX. Otherwise, we're going to continue on. Um, I think I've played all the California stuff I brought with me for today, but uh, we'll move on into the Midwest, if that sounds good to you. Uh, up next is Skafish, um, spelled S-K-A-F-I-S-H, and uh, recommend his webpage. I believe it's just skafish.com. That's S-K-A-F-I-S-H. A lot of very interesting information. And from things you may not have even wanted to know about Skafish are on there. And uh, and I, I think they might be posting some uh, unreleased tracks pretty soon uh, in MP3 or real audio format, though I'm not positive. Um, but for more information, Skafish.com. And uh, this is from his first album. This is Joan Fan Club, the opening track. Uh, real zonky number. Zonk being Zolo plus Punk. And um, that's that. I uh, came out, what, 79 IRS Records? Here's Skafish from Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> Barbie, come on right in. I think we have a lot of things to talk about. You know, when I was in high school, I was a cheerleader and I was very popular. I went on dates, to dances, to parties, and I had so much fun. Now, it's a few years later, and I'm just waiting to fall in love with that right person. Then, everything will be wonderful.
Listening to the new waves of the coaster on KV Rex Austin 91.7 FM. I'm your host, Captain Quality, with you every Wednesday at 9 p.m. for the new waves of the coaster. And uh, tonight we are playing Zolo uh, from within the new wave between 77 and 82, roughly, and uh, from within the U.S. as well. So we're playing, I started at 8 p.m. tonight, a little bit unusual, but um, circumstance called and, uh, well, you know. And so uh, we're playing, have played, uh, about one and a half hours so far of U.S. Zolo from within the new wave. And uh, continue for the next half hour. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, the number is 495-KVRX. We just listened to Standing Waves from Austin here. Uh, that was 1980. They're uh, integrating circuits 7-inch. Before that, the Dancing Cigarettes with um, a song from their School of Secret Music. It's a reissue of work between 80 and 83. They're from Illinois. West Side Lockers before that with uh, Fuchsia Rayon. Uh, they were from Olympia, Washington. That also came out in 1980 on a single. Um, before that, a band from Detroit playing I'm In Touch With Your World from their very first self-titled album. And uh, before that, Wasmo Nariz with She Needs It from his second album, 1981, Tell Me How to Live. Skayfish started out that set with Joan Fan Club, uh, Zolo Plus Punk equals Zonk number. That's from his very first album, 1979, IRS Records. Uh, it was a self-titled album. You can tell because it has, uh, oh, the oh-so-odd-looking Skayfish on the cover. Um, he actually has a pretty good website, skayfish.com. That's S-K-A-F-I-S-H, if you're interested in him. There's quite a bit of information about him and his life uh, from the beginning to the present. And uh, available online. Uh, up next is a couple other Austin Zolo tunes from some Austin New Wave groups. Um, a little bit different from the Standing Waves. Each had sort of their own personality. We're going to play Delta coming up next with a song called Mr. E. Chaos from their, I believe they're only 7-inch. I don't know anything about Delta. If anyone knows anything about Delta, please give me a call, 495-KVRX. And uh, after that, I'll play some Uranium Savages from their second album. So, um, that's that, and uh, here's Delta with Mr. E. Chaos on the New Age of Coaster on KBRX Austin.
Someone's in the back yard. Someone's in an elevator growing up. Someone's in the kitchen growing up. Someone's in the backyard growing up on me. On me. Mongo, don't stay at home. Mongo,
you the new way Zillow Coaster on Key Virex Austin 91.7 FM. And uh, I am your host, Captain Quality. We just listened to the Talking Heads playing Girls Want to Be with the Girls from the 1978 album. More songs about buildings and food. X Teens before that uh, with their 1982 first release, Happy Again. They're from North Carolina, I believe. Uh, Gary Allen from Who Knows Where, somewhere here in the U.S., uh, with Mongol at Home from his 1982 EP, In White America. A couple Austin bands before that, the Uranium Savages with Mad at the World uh, from their Radioactive LP, and Delta with Mr. E. Chaos from their, uh, I believe, only 7-inch, 1980, 1981. Uh, If anyone has any information about Delta, I would be more than happy, more than grateful if you gave me a call. 495-KKVRX is the number, and uh, that's the number if you have any other questions, comments, or concerns about the show, want to know where you can get a hold of any of this stuff, et cetera, et cetera. And uh, that's that. Uh, so tonight on the show, we have been playing Zulu um, during the new wave from the U.S. So that's between 77 and 82, roughly, and uh, all the groups from the U.S. Um, the next uh, few songs I'm going to play are actually from artists who were not born here in the U.S., but who transferred here to, uh, oh, I don't know, uh, start their musical careers um, or expand on their musical careers either or and uh, that would be Yoko Ono I'm going to play first Uh, Nina Hagen and Klaus Nomi I played Snakefinger a little earlier on I guess he would fit in in this section as well but uh, here's Yoko Ono with Kiss 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 from the Double Happiness album Uh, came out I believe was it 80? 81? something like that anyway very Zolo very fun and uh, that's that
was the Tom Tom Club with Le Elephant from their first album, uh, self-titled album. And before that, to close, Nomi with Simple Man from uh, his Simple Man LP. That's his second LP. Came out around 81 or 82. Nina Hagen before that with Tai Chi Tarot. And yes, that is her real voice. Uh, same goes for Klaus Nomi. In fact, we had three incredible voice talents in a row because before Nina Hagen was Yoko Ono with Kiss, Kiss, Kiss from the Double Happiness album. Came out around 1980. Um, so you've been listening to the New Waves of Coaster on KVRX Austin. I've been your host, Captain Quality. And up next is more zaniness with the Nummy Muffin Cocoa Butter. Woohoo! You heard right. Woohoo! Anyhow, um, let's see. Uh, I guess that's it. 495-KVRX is the number if you have any questions, comments, or concerns before I leave the station. And... Um, I'm going to end off with one song uh, by a Los Angeles group called IUD. And uh, the song is called Bon Appetit. And uh, it's from around uh, 80, 81, something like that. And, uh, yes, it's just a couple of sisters. Um, I think one of them's name is Barbie, and the other one's name is Zoo or something like that. A strange c- couple of uh, kids. Anyhow, um, here it is, uh, IUD with uh, Bon Appetit from a single of theirs. Right. 